Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Monkey Island 2. Last time we left off we were over here on this stupid island with the cottage, finally. And there's a few things I need to do here. Um, first of all, I need to get into this hole. Too short. You say you're too short, which makes me think I need a ladder, and there is a ladder in the library. So maybe. I don't know though. Um, but let's go up here to the path and go in here. So, I kind of futzed around with this for a very small amount of time uh, last time, but uh, I do want to get back here to the cottage. So yeah, the, the, the window's open. Oh, is that what I do? That's what I do. That's why I opened that window last time. I was thinking to myself in between uh, videos, I was like, is there like a potted plant I can toss it in or something? I can totally toss what you have out the window and I can drink my grog. Back again, eh? Let's get this over with. Come on in. Yeah, let's do it. I'll get us set up. Thank you. Give me I my can't drink. Leave your back for more. Most people just give up and go away. Yep, the shutters are over there. So how really much near like do I have left? Away. Well, a third of a bottle. You're serious about this contest. Uh -huh. Here's your drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very serious, actually. There's a special I'm drink gonna, that I like. I'm gonna win it's this contest. Than I will. Oh yeah, uh huh. It's weaker than a sponge soaked Fort in tongue, water. huh? That's crazy. I cases and cases no. of it. That doesn't seem to work. Use it. Then Not that the shutters, but the windows. You... Ago. So I started drinking rum to fill the gap in my life. Nice. Come on, don't tell me you can't just throw Are that you out sure the window. You don't back out? Oh my God, no, what? Thanks. I'm a pro. Guybrush, you stupid you idiot. First. Just throw! The window's right there! Okay, well, apparently my solution was incorrect. Okay, we're gonna try the tree this time. It made just as much sense to me to just throw it out the damn window, Guybrush, but whatever. Do we use it on the plant? The tree. There we go. Thank you, God. Uh-huh. That was Did you when know? I took up rum. There Are you we go. Sure you don't want to back out? No thanks. So I filled it up I'll with Neergrog, right? You drink first. All right, so we should live this time, right? <sighs> now it's your turn. Thank you. I need more though, right? Oh. Yes. There we go. It, it, the, the window made just as much sense to me. Come on. I just needed somewhere to throw it. <laughs> well, I'm glad I had the plant idea in my head, too. Because that's such a common thing. Just pour your drink out in the plant. But come on, the door and window were open. I can't hold my alcohol. They're half empty. I can't hold my alcohol. Ha ha ha. He he he. I can't hold my alcohol. God, you have a lot of bottles of rum, you know that? Okay, and there's probably nothing I, I can do with that. I can't hold my alcohol. Can I grab the stool? Nice! Uh... I don't want to sit right now. Okay, so that's not an option. Empty grog mug? Okay, I can grab these. I think I'll leave it here for Rum Rogers. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can grab that for whatever I need that for. Mirror frame. This is what There's I needed the bricks to look at. Stupid mirror for. Here, mirror frame. Now what? Why do I even have this? And why do I even put it there? That is a nice looking beard. One thing's for sure. I am never shaving this off. Interesting. What? What? Why did I put the mirror there and I can take the mirror away? Am I doing like a reflecting light puzzle or some something? I'm suspicious. Hello, tree. Looks like a tree to me. Uh huh. Brick. Push. Oh, okay. Well, I was gonna ask how I get down here, but oh. Oh well, that sucks. You're still passed out, aren't you? So falling down there probably is not the solution by just stepping on the trap door like that. Please tell me you're still asleep and I don't have to do that again. Okay, yeah, you're still out. Good. Good, good, good. So how am I supposed to get down here without 
screwing things up here. Liquor cabinet? He certainly does like his rum. Okay, trapdoor. I'm not a mason. A brick is a brick is a brick. I don't want to carry that around. Just like the trapdoor I had when I was a kid. It's already closed. It won't budge. Hmm. So yeah, I can only... I can just fall down there. So... How am I supposed to stop myself from just completely falling down and being screwed, right? How am I supposed to stop that from happening? Can I, do I have something in here to, like, break my fall? <clears throat> or could I push the trapdoor... Could I, like, push the thing from far away? Like, can we use the ore with the brick? I don't think that needs a paddle. Yes, it does. We could do it from far away and then we wouldn't fall straight down. We could, like, climb down or something. All right, let's just push it again. What, what can I do whoa, here? Whoa. Yeah, you fell. Okay, there's like a giant... There's like a giant clothespin thing that like pushes me out. Can I break that or something? It looked like a clothespin. How do I break that? There's gotta be some way to get rid of it, right? Well, I mean, there's a few things to, to do here, right? I have the... I have what this- that's on this plaque written down. When I can see far, you are near. Mm, I can see far, you are near. Uh... I can see far. I mean, that makes me think of like a telescope, but... I don't have a telescope. No. Does that have something to do with this? Do I have to solve whatever that puzzle is before I can do this one, maybe? Or is it, like, what's this mirror do and all of this other jazz? I don't understand. Because there's, like, a giant thing here. I mean, I found this. But, yeah, when I whoa, when whoa, I do whoa. that, this happens. Right? Because there's the map piece. I can clearly see it, but... Hmm. Alright, I use Jojo on the brick. Jojo pushes it, and we're good. No. Use Jojo on the trapdoor. I don't think that'll work. Damn. Uh, I can't like pickpocket you or anything. No. All right, I mean, I feel like there's a puzzle here that I can solve, but I don't know what it is yet. To me, it seems like a reflecting light puzzle, you know, like, like a mirror puzzle, because I put this mirror on the wall. Maybe the monkey, once I put something on the monkey, Maybe a telescope. It activates like a beam of light that comes out of your ass. And that might be why I opened the window. It goes through the window, reflects off the mirror into the brick, maybe? And that does something? I don't know what. Maybe it turns that thing down there around. I, I don't know. But there's got to be a reason I collected all of that stuff. Okay. Yeah, let's just, let's just go. So I think I'm gonna go back to the big tree. All right, I'm back at the big tree. I have the, the two planks I need. What do I do with this though? This, this plank is now reinforced. So I can use this to get here. It's already right? in use. And I can pick this one up and put it over here so I can get even further along, right? Like, is this what I'm supposed to do? Kind of... It's already in use. Get myself over here like this? I don't know, maybe? This is what I was thinking. I kind of staircase hmm, myself I up. I the idea. Yeah. Uh-huh. Guybrush, thank you. <gasps> oh, and that gets us up here! Oh, I was one... I was trying to think of a way to solve how to get to the top holes. But no, here we are. Okay, cool. So this was... So yeah, all I had to do was fix the thing. <gasps> There's a telescope right there. Right there. I bet that's what I need for the monkey. I bet that's what I need for the monkey. So, I can look at this. I rush is very slowly there's making his way up there. there. It's already open. It's already open and there's nothing interesting, you say. Yeah, I see that telescope up there. That is interesting, though. Okay, okay. So, maybe this is what I need. And this is... Yeah, you! You jackass. Oh, you have a big pile... ...of those. Hey! It's hundreds and hundreds of maps. 
push bird. Uh, no way. He looks like he bites. Uh, no way. He looks like he bites. Uh, no way. Okay. Well, looks like he bites. That didn't work. I don't want them all, and I can't tell which one is Governor Marley's. Well, how am I supposed to know that? Hmm. I have no idea how I would be able to tell which one is the correct map. Let's see. Look at my inventory here. No. I mean, I don't know, right? How would I be able to tell which map is Governor Marley's in a room full of maps, basically? I have no earthly idea. Do I... So the only thing I have from Marley is the ore that's downstairs. I have zero idea. I mean, there's also the problem with the seagull being right here, right? Maybe if I... That doesn't seem to work. Use the map, like another map piece on... No, I can't give it. Okay, so I probably give those to, um, Wally, right? Can you? I don't think that'll work. What? Maybe I just try using all my items on this pile. Maybe it's something I'm not thinking about. I don't think I should use it indoors. Oh, come on, Guybrush. There's not even anybody here. I was thinking I could scare the bird off with the ship's horn. Okay, I don't know how to get rid of this bird, and I don't know how to do anything with the pile, so... It's lovely Booty Island. How do I actually get to where that telescope is? Because now I'm like, get me to the telescope, please. I know where the stupid maps are, but how do I get to telescope? Maybe I need another item for this? I have no idea. So, do I just... Oh, you walk around behind. Okay. I thought you were gonna walk through here and there would be a back door that led up there. But I guess that's what the sign was supposed to tell me. Okay, well I at least know how to do something back at the other place now. I really have no idea what to do here. Should I grab another hint for this? I tried everything in my inventory. So, I mostly just want confirmation if we need another item or not. You won't be able to find the map piece under that mess of papers. That's all you're gonna give me, huh? I know I can press it a second time for another hint. I'm trying to avoid that. Hmm. I won't be able to find the map piece under that mess of papers. So you're saying I gotta clean it up somehow, right? But how? Hmm. I don't know. I, I don't want to take another hint yet. Let's just see if maybe going back to the other place and doing that will solve something. I I don't know. Also, what is this outhouse for? Don't know. Don't know at all. Oh yeah, and people people told me that yeah, there's something. There's probably something in my inventory that Guybrush wrote down the lyrics on. I mean, I guess that makes sense, but what? I thought I examined all of the paper things in my inventory, but maybe I didn't? Something of the thread, something of the head, something of the body, and something of the dead. Ah. Wow, that was immediate. It was the spit-encrusted paper. I've only tried to use it recently. I didn't try to look at it. Okay, so this is what we have here. Cool. Oh, damn it. I closed out of the game. Alright, so, yeah, we have that. That's good. That is very, very good. Alright, I'm over here with my telescope. Here you go. Is this yes? Yes. Okay, and exactly like I thought. I've played enough JRPGs to know, alright, about mirror puzzles. Believe me. If you wanted me to solve one, I could even do that. Okay, so it's just pointed me to the wall, though. Is that even useful? Right? Unless it somehow fixed the problem down here that didn't accomplish anything, yeah? Yeah, no, it's still there! Okay, so that, that did nothing. That just showed me what I already knew. Because, yeah, there's a suspicious brick on the wall. Of course I'm gonna try and push it. I don't need to do some convoluted puzzle with a monkey to know that. Oh, there's like a... A brick is a brick is burn a brick. mark on this one? Okay, these aren't listed as, like, different bricks. It all just says brick. Maybe I do have to actually select the correct one, which is this one? Whoa. Maybe. Please. Okay, that's what it was. Yeah, there was a burn mark on the correct one. But slide. It's 
Screw you, butt slide. Let's just pull you this way. Let's keep you that way. Give me that, please. That makes three map pieces. Only one to go. Only one to go. Skeleton in bathtub. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. Looks like he died while taking a bath. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. Skeletons don't talk. No, oh, but come on. I was hoping to get something. Okay, so there's one final map piece. Hand and map. Cool, we got we got the hand too. Can I like remove the hand from the map? <laughs> or is the is the hand stuck on there? So there's got to be so yeah, we know where the final map piece is. It's in that pile. I'm clearly just missing like something small. Like I said, this is always the most difficult part of um of uh adventure games when it's like you're down to the final puzzle and you might be missing like one thing. You just don't know what it is. Like, it seems like I need to clean up the things somehow, but... I don't, like, what, a broom? Do I, like, do a gust of wind needs to come through and it'll blow all the ones it's except my map piece away magically? I'm not, I'm not putting anything past this game at this point. Alright, it's, it's had some pretty crazy logic here, so... It could be anything. Deep within oh. the Chuck's fortress, blah, 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 blah. Forgot about this. Largo. Yeah. Uh, you called for me? Is it true that Guybrush Threepwood has found the third piece of the map to Big Whoop? Ah, yes, sir. I was about. Why did you not come and tell me yourself? Well, I was trying to confirm that he really. Largo, you have been my trusted henchman for many years, but I won't hesitate to drag your entrails from behind my ship. If you do not bring me Guybrush before he finds that treasure! I'd get my ass in gear, Largo. Just saying. I mean, the only new item I have in my inventory is... This, right? There's nothing in my grog mug. Wait, wait. I only wait. drink part of it. Yeah, that's nothing. I mean, I didn't try to use the drinks on you, I don't think, because I was like, why would I? I think I should save this for later. Maybe I can impress Elaine with how far I can spit. Oh, wow. If I would have tried to use that on random things, I... Yeah. Might have been able to get a hint there. That doesn't seem to work. And the brown drink, that no. doesn't seem to work. Yeah, I mean, I didn't think it would, but I'm kind of desperate at this point. So, telescope? That doesn't seem to work. No. Alright, the first hint didn't give me anything, so what's the second hint say? If you had a dog to help you sniff out the map piece, it would help? A dog? The only dog I think we've seen was at Marley's place. Didn't I try to pick up that dog? I swear I did when I got there, and it was like, I don't think you would like that, or not my type. Right? I thought I tried, but there's a very, very high chance I, I just didn't. The whole picking up living creatures thing and stuffing it into my pocket, you know, will always be like, whoa, to me? So, you, right? You're the only dog I know of. Okay, dog. You're coming with me. Really? <laughs> okay. Okay. Yep. Uh, uh-huh. Yeah. Alrighty. Well then. Yeah, that was just what I had to do. I thought I tried that when I first came here, but I guess not. Or it just doesn't let you until, like, the dog goes to sleep or something. I, I don't know. I don't know. But I should press pick up on everything. This has been established. So, there we go. We have dog. I can honestly say without that hint, I wouldn't have gotten that. Because I wouldn't have thought to go back over there and get it. I was thinking, like, a broom or wind or something to blow the map pieces away or scaring off the bird but no I was not thinking using a dog to sniff it out so not concerned about that hint at all all right use dog with pile it's crazy but it just might work what was crazier was Hello? getting the dog right? in the first place good boy run along home now there you go who's your good papa now that's a good dog yeah gee I still can't make heads or tails of it. I think I need an expert. Okay, well, luckily I know this part of the puzzle. We have already we have already done this. I've given you your monocle back. That's why I took the lens out of the lighthouse. Wally will be able to read my map, put it together for me. 
and we can end this chapter. My god. Feels like we've been here forever. So this is a good, like, 50-60% of the game, probably, because... I think last time I saved, I was like, like, 70-something percent of the way through? Or close to that. Oh, you're so dead. Well, Chuck, sir, I got good news, and I got bad news. The bad news is that Guybrush has found the last piece of the map. Nah, the good news is that I got a plan that can't fail. Ah, you see? He must take the map to a cartographer to have it deciphered. I'll head him off before he gets there. If your plan fails... It will not, your voodoo lordship. Alright, Largo. Oh, for your sake. You're gonna head me off, huh? I'm already here. So what are you gonna do about that? Uh... Huh. Yeah, you, you weren't Hello. very good at heading me off. Wow, okay. Here you go, Wally. What's this? A map? Hmm. Looks like only part of a map. I've got the rest of it right here. Hmm. Very interesting. Can you put it all together into one map for me? I'll do it for you if you run an errand for me. Go Horse. to the International House of Mojo and ask the fortune teller if my love potion's ready. Okay. I'll try to have this done for you when you come back. Love potion? Isn't that a little creepy, Wally? Forcibly making someone fall in love with you for drugs? Unless, I don't know, you're drinking the love potion yourself so that you'll love yourself more. Which, you know, if that's the case, relatable. I always like cutting out that trip because it takes a little bit too long for my Not taste. Again, Mr. Threepwood. Wally sent me to pick up some love potion. Oh, okay. Tell him I said to enjoy, but to be careful. It's powerful stuff. Wouldn't want that little guy getting hurt. Wait, I just felt a sudden disturbance in the falls. As if a tiny, tiny voice just called out in fear, and then hastily scratched a message in a table. I think Wally's in trouble, and I think LeChuck has something to do with it. Uh-oh, I better go check. Scratched into a table. That feels important. It's probably Wally's table. Also, yeah, big, big Star Wars reference. Big, big Star Wars reference, which... I mean, it is LucasArts that make these games. I'm surprised I haven't seen more Star Wars references. So... Yeah. I wonder why... Yeah, I mean, maybe LucasArts just didn't want to, but I feel like a, like... A Star Wars point-and-click adventure game would have been pretty awesome. You know? I played a lot of Star Wars games. In fact, I would say it's most of my exposure to Star Wars because I've watched the movies, but not a ton or anything, and definitely haven't watched all of them. But I have played KOTOR, or watched KOTOR 1 and 2, played all the Battlefront games, played like Rogue Squadron, all those things. So. Alright, what's going on in here? Are you dead, Wally? Where'd you go? There's the message. Someone's hastily scratched a message here. It just says... LeChuck! Oh no! LeChuck's kidnapped the cartographer! The poor little guy! Hey! He has my map! Well now we gotta find him. It just says... LeChuck! Where am I going then? Nice map! Uh... Just says LeChuck. Do I like know where LeChuck's fortress is or something so I can go and steal my map back? What, what am I doing here? It just says LeChuck. Uh, let's see here. There's some matches in here. And something that says Love Bomb on it. Ooh. Who am I gonna make love me? Instructions. One, light fuse. Two, throw at target. Three, get ready for love. Okay, we gotta be very careful who we use that on. International House of Mojo. Okay. So what am I supposed to do now, then? I is there anything I need to do with the hastily scrawled, scrawled message? Like... I mean, I'm guessing not, right? But maybe... What would I do with it? Can I use no. the love bomb? I want to save it for Elaine. Oh. I'm no pyromaniac. It's open. Okay, so, yeah, we can't use any of those things. I don't know. 
I was thinking you would maybe need to do it's it felt important, but all it just all it says is LeChuck, so I'm like Where do go? Um LeChuck. Cemetery, swamp, beach. I don't suppose you dorks know where LeChuck is, right? I don't know. We haven't talked to them in a while. Maybe they have something new to say. Maybe we can be like, we found them at the Big Whoop. I think. How you two doing? He's back. Uh, nope. Well, I'll see you salty dogs later. Alright, boring. You're both boring. Bye-bye. So, there's got to be a way for me to figure out how to get to where LeChuck is. I mean, I, I doubt I'm just going to walk up and Captain Dread knows, right? Maybe there's a book at the library? I don't recall seeing a book about LeChuck, but... I mean, there, were, there was a hey, memoir written by Guybrush about how to kill LeChuck, but... Yeah, I legitimately have no idea where to go now. Huh. You said... The only other idea I have is you said... You were saving the love bomb for Marley. Marley is not back. I'm diving back into the card catalog. Alright, I was grabbing everything that had LeChuck in the name, which was just a bunch of things written by Guybrush, and I was like, well, at least that might be funny to look at. There was another one, too, but I can only check out three at once. Where I blew up LeChuck. Ugh, the catalog was right. This is pretty bad. When I blew up LeChuck. Ugh, the catalog was right. This is pretty bad. Okay, so they're all the same. Damn it. I was like, I don't know, maybe... I don't know, I thought they'd be funny. Can you please tell me something? Guybrush, you don't have any time to waste. I can offer you no more help. Your destiny <laughs> is in your own hands now. Where the hell do I go, though? Ah, uh, I don't know where to go. I feel like there's probably some pertinent information that I'm just not remembering, like something to do with LeChuck that was earlier in the story, but I... That was so long ago, I don't remember now. If there even was anything. Like, where... I guess I can go back... If I go back to the room with Wally, I can probably... get a hint there. I, I need something. I, I have no idea where to go. Absolutely. At all. It was probably, like, some innocuous thing that I just ran across that was like, Ah, oh, this is... here's where LeChuck is. I just don't remember it. Oh, this is the wrong place. But, yeah, I don't recall it at all if there's anything. Alright, let's use the hint here. Need to find a book of voodoo spells to give to the voodoo lady. What? No, I don't. It just oh, says... Oh, no. LeChuck. Probably found a book of voodoo spells at the library. Yeah, nope, I'm not getting any help from this. Oh god, so I can't even use the hint system. I can't even use the hint system. Does it really just want you to just explore until you find something? <sighs> um... I mean, I can try asking around with the residents to see if any of them saw Largo, I guess? <sighs> I talked to everybody in Woodtick and there's nothing. I... Really don't know. This feels like the final piece of the puzzle here. But I have... No idea. I can't think of anywhere. It might be in one of the early cutscenes or something. Maybe I can, like, rewatch some of my videos? Like, what... In the cutscenes that I got when I collected the map fragments, was there anything? Okay, I was 100% lost. I had no idea what to do. So I just had to look up where ex what exactly we have to do next. And once again, I don't think it's something I would have realized. I might have examined this later and known, but... To the Ghost Pirate LeChuck. Care of LeChuck's Island Getaway and Spa. Contents, miscellaneous voodoo supplies. So, I might have read that way earlier in the game and just forgot to note it, but I can honestly say, if I would have sat here for the next two weeks, I don't think I would have thought of this, so... Let's get in. I think there's something moving in here. <sighs> hey, Rich! I sure could use a hand with this one. I tried watching my old videos uh, and didn't see anything about like it. another box of live snakes. Sounds Ooh. like it, too. 
Well, let's get it on the truck. Oh my god. Wow. Jeez. Just something as simple as a crate. Just chilling. In the small crate of voodoo supplies that would be his home for the next five days and nights, Guybrush is forced to eat bat lungs and eel bladders to stay alive. Eventually, so? Guybrush and the rest of the slithering cargo are delivered to the very doorstep of the Caribbean's most fearsome villain, living or dead, the ghost pirate, LeChuck. Ah, LeChuck's crate of voodoo supplies. You know, we usually don't deliver out this far, and... You guys fucking for a tip? Well, we figured since... Well, you figured wrong. LeChuck don't tip nobody. Gee, what a butt. Ick, I hate snakes. That must have been a really rough ride, Guybrush. Okay, well... We're here. I still have so much useless junk in my inventory. I'm fairly sure, but I don't know, maybe we need all of this, like an empty grog mug? I don't know. But phew, okay, that was rough. That that probably would have been made easier if I had taken special note of the fact that that, that crate went to LeChuck earlier. But yeah, that was, that was hard. This game is hard, okay? 76% though, we only have 24% of the game left, so we are certainly getting there. But uh, I have recorded for over an hour today, and I'm not sure how long this video is, but... <sighs> Alrighty, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Monkey Island 2, and I'll see you next time for some more.